introducing our referee in charge of this bout, George Gallegos. And now, introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, he is wearing blue trunks to rip it baby blue. He is training out of King's MMA in Huntington Beach, Huntington of Anaheim. He weighed 206 pounds. Tonight, he is making his debut. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Patrick Yabumbo! His opponent, across the cage, fighting out of the red corner. He is also wearing blue trunks, trimmed in baby blue. He is training out of Burbank Legacy by way of Kankaki, Illinois. He weighed 196 pounds. He is also making his debut. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing George Keto Killer. Started off here, George Harris in the red corner coming up against Patrick Yapoko in the 205-pound weight class. Opening bout here at Spar Star 52. Thank you all for tuning in. Happy New Year to everybody out there. Looking forward to a great year of fights. Fighters touch gloves. We got three two-minute rounds. Shin guards in full effect. Harris eats a right hand pressed up against the cage. <clears throat> Yapoko getting busy up against the cage here. Looking to get this fight to the ground. He's got a decent lock around the, around the body. Harris does get him down. Crawls into the half guard here. Harris had a decent underhook. It looks like he's about to give up his back, though. Does a nice job of tripoding up to his feet. but gets tossed back down to the mat. Yapoko all over him here. Harris trying to dig for underhooks, but he's going to go for a ride again. This time he bridges, almost gets the reversal. Ends up in bottom mount, eating some ground and pound for his trouble. Yapoko just doing a nice job of staying on him with this ground groundwork here. Another takedown. A nice single leg runs the pipe, gets him down into that half guard again. Yapoko looks like he might be fishing for some kind of a choke here, but it's difficult to finish from that angle. He's switching off to a front headlock here. Possibly an arm in guillotine. Looks like he might sit back for it. He does. He has the neck. Harris in trouble here. He's got no arm in to defend, and he got to like, forced to tap out. Yapoko with the guillotine victory. Nice debut effort here from Patrick Yapoko out of Kings MMA. He's been improved to 1-0 in his debut fight. That's off to Harris for getting in there and giving it a shot. Never really got any offense going. Was pushed up against the cage immediately, taken down a few times. And found himself caught in that guillotine submission, forced to tap. Take a look at the replay here. You can see Yapoko doing a nice job of getting some takedowns. Harris tried to bridge him over, almost had him there, but left his neck out here. Just kind of a rookie mistake here to fall right into that guillotine. Didn't really seem to know how to defend. It was a nice guillotine, though, by Yapoko. Not taking anything away from him. Right under the neck. Right under the chin, rather, around the throat. Forced to tap out. Right here, Harris had an opportunity to hop over that right leg of Yapoko to get to the, the clear side to free his head, but was unable to do so. Yapoko, I'm sure he's proud of himself. Ladies and gentlemen, at one minute, four seconds of round number one, the referee in charge, George Gallegos, stops the contest. Due to a tap out submission, guillotine choke, our winner, in the blue corner, Patrick Yapoko! There you have it, Patrick Yapoko coming away with the victory, improves to 1 0. Look forward to seeing him again if he decides to come back. going to bring us up 
to our second fight of the night. It's going to be a welterweight contest, 170 pounders. Debut fighters Brian Noriega out of Kings MMA. Up against Joseph Deacon, 10th planet San Diego. Stay tuned.